vlog family. Happy Easter! Today is Easter Sunday. Dan and I are currently just relaxing, sitting on the couch. Dan's working on paper and following some sports. We're watching hockey right now and we went to church this morning and then I went out to brunch with some of my Sunday school friends and now we're back. I went out and did some grocery shopping for today. We're having, we're making some, uh, like just basically like cheeseburgers and stuff today for dinner. And now we're just relaxing. Kristen is on her way over to drop off Gwen the ferret. So I'll definitely show that so you guys can see Gwen. But yeah, it's been a very relaxing Easter. It's been cool out. It's actually been pretty cool out, but we have the sliding door open because it's still, it's, it feels good. So there's a blue skies, and it's just, it's a very relaxing day so far. Excellent. Hi, Gwen. Ferret items. How are you? Oh, oh, I thought, I thought you like left. And like, <laughs> like ferret <laughs> items and you're gone. <laughs> no, I just shut the door. <laughs> <laughs> where Gwen could be. <laughs> Dan and I are just sitting here trying to watch some baseball and enjoy some pizza and I just can't help but feeling that we're being watched. Yankee Stoners over the last six games have been very, very good. That's why the team is five and one. So with all of the in there. So yeah, just the way I like it. Say these think good. I got home from work and I took a bath and got cleaned up and relaxed a little bit and then Gwen was asleep in her little hide and I like quietly and slowly opened the door and just left it open and she woke up a few minutes later and she's out now like running around and exploring but she took so long to get ready like she needed me to get her out of the cage because she was like she would move and then just yawn and look at me like, I don't have energy to climb out of this. And then she would stand up and just look at me over it and like look down like, I wish I could come out. Too bad I'm too sleepy to move this much. So I let her out and then she like walked around and stretched a bit. And now she's just having a good old time, aren't ya? Also, I'm sorry if you don't like ferrets because this is not going to be a vlog for you. I'm pretty sure the entire vlog this week is going to be just Gwen. I mean, that's adorable. Gwen, you're adorable. My shoes are filthy. <laughs> oh gosh, exposed. 
Are you having a great time? What are you doing? I need those. Don't destroy those. So Gwen is trying very hard to find things to play with. And Dan said when they had ferrets growing up, they loved little like Nerf balls because they could sink their teeth into them and destroy them. And the only Nerf thing we have is Dan's Packers Nerf football. And he had this up on the table when I got home, meaning he was keeping it out of Gwen's reach. I just talked to him on the phone and asked if we had anything that Gwen could play with because she's going at rim reams of paper for entertainment. And he said to give her the Nerf ball. So we're gonna see if she wants to play with it. You don't want the Nerf ball? Gwen, Gwen. Look at it! Ah, oh, destroy it! Oh, you don't like the taste of cheese? Eh, well, it's worth a try. Maybe she'll go at it later. I feel like this entire vlog has just been Gwen and nothing else and I'm getting water on my head. But I thought I'd go ahead and just catch up with you guys a little bit because yeah, I just I feel, I feel like this entire vlog has just been nothing but Gwen, which isn't a bad thing at all. Um, we will have her through part of next week as well, so she will be in next week's vlog as well. But I'm currently standing outside right next to a tree. There was a nice sudden storm that just went through crazy wind and rain and all sorts of stuff and there was thunder happening. I, don't, I didn't look outside to see if there was any lightning, but uh, that just blew through quickly and Dan had to run to Aldi Quick to get some potatoes and then called me and was like, hey, <laughs> this random storm messed up the electricity at Aldi, so I need cash. So he just ran back to get cash and he's now going to buy the potatoes and then he'll be right back. All of this to say, this is a very exciting story, I know. All of this to say, I figured I'd just wait outside for him instead of going back inside because as soon as he gets home and drops those off, he's back to the school because come Tuesday, he's officially done with school. So he is working as hard as he can to get this final paper done and I am very proud of him. He needs to spend as much time as he physically can at the library to use as many resources as he can and to be able to focus as much as he can. So that's where his mind is right now. But I'm gonna go inside after I get these potatoes and get started on supper prep stuff. We are making another state recipe tonight. And to go with that, I'm going to make a loaf of bread, which I don't think I've ever actually made. Maybe once I've tried making a loaf of bread. I've made like 
uh, like burger buns and rolls and biscuits and things like that before plenty of times and like pizza dough and pizza crust and stuff like that but I've never actually made just a single loaf of bread that turned out well. I think the one time I did make it, it did not turn out well. So I'm gonna give that another go for tonight and hopefully that will work out well. But the bread is not the state recipe, it just would be a nice pair with it. So that's, that's, about, that's about it. Uh, this week hasn't been that exciting. That's probably why I've not filmed that much of me. It's just been a lot of work, coming home, being exhausted, going to sleep, going back to work, coming home, being exhausted, going to sleep. So that's been my riveting week. But Gwen is here for the vlog's entertainment, which allows me to sort of take a break a bit and not worry about finding things to film, which is nice too. I'm making a loaf of bread for the first time and I'm really excited with how it looks pre-bake stage, but I'm really hoping it turns out well. So I will let you know. Look at that. Listen, ready? It's a hard outer crust. It's not raw, I hope. I'm really proud of myself. The real test is gonna be letting it cool and actually cutting into it, but I'm really proud of myself. Look at the current state of our floors. We have recycling laying everywhere in just a box. We have these uh, cardboard tubes there, there, and over there. And we have that, I think we just left there accidentally. Then we have a ball there. I think there's a red ball that's a little smaller than that hanging around somewhere. We have a stuffed animal over there. And then we have all these boxes. We're not turning into slobs, I promise. Um, all of this stuff is out and about because Gwen has a blast playing with all of it when she's running around. She will like run through these tubes and drag them around the place. So those are just spread out everywhere for her to have options. And she likes, she doesn't like that ball as much, but there's a little red like bouncy ball that she loves. And I don't know where that went. She stashed it somewhere. And then the recycling... She really likes chewing on these guys, which we keep an eye on her when she's chewing on those, the plastic water bottles. And these little boxes, she can dig, her, she can just like burrow through. So she really likes this one especially. So we're not like turning into absolute slobs and just leaving trash all over the place. We're purposefully leaving it out for her to play with. But I just wanted to make that known in case I'm filming and I'm like this talking to you guys and you can see the background and you're like, wow, Julie and Dan have really let themselves go. <laughs> we haven't, I promise. <laughs> Where are you going, Gwen? get stuck all right and I am ending the vlog there I am very very tired it has been a very tiring week but good news is I will have two days off to relax and to jump back into next week so I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. I hope you have enjoyed spending some time with Gwen and she will be in next week's vlog as well because I will have her for part of next week as well. And I hope to see you guys then. Have a great week. Bye.